Hi there, and uh, welcome to our next look at constellation. Today we're going to look at Pisces Hostrinus, a southern sky constellation meaning the southern fish. It contains six stars with planets, no Messier objects, and just two formally named stars. And there are no meteor showers associated with it, so this won't be very long. The major stars are Formalut, um, Alpha Pisces Ostrini, the brightest star in the constellation with an apparent magnitude of 1.16. It's also the 18th brightest star in the sky, a white main sequence star, 25.13 light years from Earth. It has about 1.92 times the sun's mass and about 1.84 times its radius. It's 16.63 times more luminous than our sun and it emits infrared radiation, which suggests it has a circumstellar disk around it. It is, in fact, surrounded by several debris disks. The name Fomalot is derived from Arabic Fom al Hout, which means the mouth of the southern fish. Fom al Hout and TW Pisces Ostrini form a binary system. And TW Pisces Ostrini is the other named star, um, known as Fomalot B. It is an orange dwarf with an apparent magnitude of 6.48. It's about 24.9 light years from us. If I can pause for one moment and just say please subscribe to this channel. It means a lot to me because it shows me that people are interested in what I'm doing. Also, it means a lot because YouTube see the subscriptions going up and realise that people like what I'm doing and, and they promote me as well. There's no money for me in this, but... Uh, Please subscribe if you can. Just click the little button at the bottom. Thank you. Let's continue. In terms of deep sky objects, no Messier objects as we say, but there's NGC 7173, which is an elliptical galaxy. It has an apparent magnitude of 11.9 and it's about 115 million light years away from us. And it was discovered by the English astronomer Herschel, John Herschel, not William, John Herschel, on September the 25th, 1834. And together with NGC 7174 and NGC 7176, it's one of three interacting galaxies in the Hickson Compact Group 90. The three galaxies will eventually merge into one supergalaxy. Uh, HGC 90, which is the Hickson Compact Group 90, is about 100 million light years away from us, as we said. Well, that's all um, for this little look at a, a little constellation. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, do stay safe, clear dark skies to you all, and speak to you next time. Bye for now.